Hey guys, welcome to uh, Built on a PC, recorded on a Mac. This edition is the PC Gaming on a Budget. I said I was going to do it last week, and I had to raise the price by $50, so here we go. We are going to do a $250 gaming PC build. Get ready. This is going to outgun my laptop so bad, and my laptop is cost like $500. Alright, let's start with the CPU. I'm going to go with the AMD A4. It's a dual core. It's 2.5 gigahertz. It actually has integrated graphics that are surprisingly not that bad. Uh, they're, they um, feature DirectX 11, and they're the AMD Radeon 6410D. Um, and it's a combo. It's a CPU plus GPU. Uh, and uh, it's $50. Not bad. Uh, I'll get to a video card later if you don't want to use integrated. Okay, for the motherboard, I'm gonna I'm gonna do the I'm gonna do the uh, MSI A55M P33 motherboard. It's got six USB two. It supports up to 16 gigabytes of RAM, um, and they can all run Max uh, 1866 megahertz. And it's got two PS2 ports, uh, three analog audio, um, and it's it's an MSI, so it's a uh, Japanese reliability. If you know what I mean. No, okay, not God, no. Alright, for the uh, RAM, I'm going to do the Crucial Ballistics. Okay, this is crazy. My computer's got, my laptop's got about 8 gigabytes of RAM, you know. And, you know, crappy uh, Kingstons. Not HyperX's. It costs like 80 bucks for 8. This is 2 gigabytes, yeah, yeah, yeah. It doesn't, and it's, it's 18... It's 1866 megahertz. Yeah. And, uh, it's efficiently cooling. And it doesn't cost 80. It costs $9. Actually, eight ninety nine. So, like, one penny off. That's crazy. $9 for this. This, this amazing, uh, Crucial Ballistics. You can have, like, I don't know, like, four of those. Isn't it two times four equals eight? Yeah! You can have, like, four of those, and you'll have eight gigabytes of RAM for 30-something dollars. No, wait. You could buy G-Skill. Never mind. Whatever. I'm going to stick with this. Because it's cheap, and it's amazing. For the GPU, we're going to go with the MSI 66, uh, the Radeon 6670s. Uh, because it's got dual fans. It, it, it cools very efficiently. It is super fast. It's got HDMI, got VGA, all that stuff. And you can run Battlefield 3, you can run, you can see about 70 FPS on dirt, and like, like, no, not 70, you can see like, 80, no, whatever, um, but this is a great graphics card for the price, you get your value for money, it doesn't fail, it's also an MSI, so it pairs up really nice with the motherboard, kind of like a nice wine and cheese, except that's not the wine. Okay, for the hard drive, we're going to use the Western Digital Caviar Blue, uh, 160 gigabytes. If you're going to do light gaming, this is the one for you. This is a great uh, 7200 RPM drive, 160 gigabytes, as it says. Plenty of storage, boots fast, and it's, super, it's a super fast hard drive, and uh, it... And, uh, you get, it's, it, you get your value for money. It's small, it's 3.5, I think, and it fits, it's a laptop hard drive, so it fits well in your desktop, and it's, like, really compact and awesome. For the case, I'm gonna go really cheapo and get a DIY PC, uh, for $20. Yeah! And it's made entirely out of plastic, and it's got two broken... Uh, USB 2.0, I'm guessing, on the front, but, you know, it, no, no, it's not broken. Uh, it's got two USB on the front, two USB 2.0s, and, uh, uh, some, a headphone and, a, a headphone and a microphone jack. So, yeah, and you can run that to that motherboard, actually. For the PSU, I'm gonna go with the Antec Basic, uh, 350 watt, uh, power supply. And it's not 80 plus certified, but most of Antec stuff is, so we're gonna go with that. And then, finally, to conclude our... To conclude this video, I'm going to go with the stupid drive. You can get a nice stupid drive. You can get, like, a Samsung stupid drive or a light-on stupid drive for, like, 17 bucks. Okay, so, in total... Oh, oh, no. No. 
Okay, in total, this whole build comes... Oh my god! Okay, whatever. In total, this entire build comes out to... I don't know if you can see it. Uh, but in, uh, in total, it comes out to $260. Well, a little bit over budget. But that is okay. Because... You know. Well, thanks for watching. $260 will get you a nice, a nice light gaming build. And, um... Uh, it will uh, it will outgun my HP. Uh, so thank you for watching. But it won't outgun my Viper. I call it that. Don't judge me. Bye.